Okay, today I'm going to do um, just a little review. Not really a review. Um, I'm going to do a tutorial on how I do my makeup. Um, it's going to be a little fast because I have to go here in a few. So I've already used two of my products. I've used the Daywear from Estee Lauder Advanced Multi Protection. focus you must focus to that and then because I have rosy ridiculousness in my face hole I use um, anti redness serum emergency repair so this is from first aid beauty I love them this stuff feels nice I don't feel greasy my face is already primed um, you put this on first seal it in with this well, whatever kind of moisturizing lotion you want. Then I'm going to use Tarte. Tarte is my favorite foundation. It's Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Full Protection. It literally stays on all day long. I don't have to mess with it. So, I mean, it is, it's phenomenal. Um, I'm pale face, you know, super pale face and, and you know, pale skin tone. So, I wear the lightest they have, which is fair beige. Um, so, I'm going to put it on the way I put it on, and you're going to be like, and then you'll understand. So, it's worth buying a kabuki brush to look gross. Hello. To have dog hair in, because, you know, I just like having dog hair in all my stuff. So, um, that was gross. Um, so, watch. It's very scientific how I do it. Just, you know. I know. Try to replicate it if you can, you know. I know it's really hard to uh, make it look as good as me because I've been doing it for so long. And I know that, you know, it's gonna. It's not going to be easy for you. I understand this. So, just do the best you can. So, it looks like I sh smeared. Smeared it smarted. Looks like I smeared a ton of product. Honestly, it's not. It's just little, little dots. Okay, so you take your dog-haired kabuki brush and just do little, little circles. And make sure you get it in your hair because that's when it looks the best. So just go ahead and get it going now. Okay, I know you're like, it's not completely covering everything at all. And I'm like, yeah, 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 give it a minute. Okay, so. And I, I also normally go back over it just a tiny bit. Um, in places like ridiculous cheek face. You know, because I am so ridiculously red in so many areas. Move this out of the way. I'm wearing a shirt that Lena gave me today because it's super cute. And I'll show you guys that before I leave. Okay. So that's just the foundation part. And then I use, um, I wipe down my kabuki brush, which is what I'm doing now. And a paper towel to dry it off. Then I use Tarte's photo finish um, in Fair Honey. I use it one shade darker than what's on my face just to give me a little color because I don't have any. <clears throat> this is a fair skin with peach undertones. So it's called Fair Honey and um, Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Airbrush Foundation. So I'll show you what it looks like. It comes in this little mesh screen. What I do is I just swirl my little little brush in it. And then apparently my virus protection has been updated. Thank you, at best. I appreciate that. It's like your virus crop has been updated. And I'm like, oh yeah. Well, that's amazing. Hey. I need a, <laughs> when you look like this, you need a photo finish. You know what I'm saying? You need to try to get as much 
coverage as possible because I don't like the shade of my skin. Alright. So, let me put just a little smidge more like right there because I don't like it. I do not wear br a blush. I don't wear blush. Probably clear, didn't it? I was getting some powder. I wasn't beating my so okay so now that I've done that I think I'm going to wear the brown that I got from um from um from Trisha so this is baby pop eyeshadow and eh all right, there we go. I think, um, yeah, I was going to say, what is the rest of it? Here it is. And then I have a Estee Lauder Pure Color Eyeshadow with a bunch of crap on it. And the color I'm going to use is, it's this one down here, which is the Tranquil Moon color. It's this color right here on the top of my lid. Okay. I have, I'm, I'm just going to use my fingers because it works better for me. I'm sure all you, you know, makeup people are going to be like, oh my god, I can't believe that bitch put her fingers in her makeup. That's disgusting. Well, nobody else is going to use it. It's my makeup. Well, okay, my husband may use it. But that's it. And he doesn't, you don't mind my fingers in my makeup, do you? No, I don't. See, here's mine. So, I mean, that's all that counts. You don't give a shit. As long as, as long as my husband's happy with my makeup, I'm happy with my makeup. You know, so, what, whatever. So, I... I love you. I don't know what he's talking about. So then I'm gonna use this this cute color. It's like a coppery brown because I'm not feeling adventurous today. And I, I can't really be adventurous. I've only got like really browns and I have like one green and I don't think the green would look good with this outfit. So I'm just gonna yeah, paint the crease. I'm not I'm not good enough to do all the the crazy like you know, smoky eyed stuff yet. I'm gonna do some I'm gonna look it up on YouTube later, which we'll not do right now because I'm busy. Let's see if I can't make a pretty smoky eye thing. But it's getting there, so you just kinda get all that going. Nice and dark on my lid. I don't have I've never bought brushes and stuff except for that kabuki brush. And those little spongy things, like, I don't like them. So. <coughs> there's that. I need to find, here it is. And then. We're going to use this. Okay, sorry the phone rang. So then I'm going to use my Maybelline Master Precise uh, by Eye Studio in Black Nor. Um, this is my favorite one so far. It wasn't that expensive. I think it was like seven dollars when I bought it. It's lasted me a super long time. And then I'm doing this in my in my eye thingy, my my iPad pod. On my no my iPad, so it doesn't really have the best camera. I mean it does, but like it's not like a mirror. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just trying to wing it.
I am by no means one of those guru ladies. But I'll fix that in a minute. And then this one's even harder. I don't know how these people go do this. I don't know how these people do this on their little makeup shows. What do you do with wax on? Uh, Like I said, I don't have a damn clue how these women do this crap in their their camera. Cause I'm blind to begin with, <coughs> and I seem to be more more blinder. Hey, stop! Stop that! Um, yeah, I seem to get more blinder as the day goes on. What the hell is that thing? There it is. <coughs> and then I use <coughs> what the hell? And then I use Urban Decay's 24/7 Velvet Glide On Eye Pencil on the bottom. Okay, and you'll see why I left this messy. Let me like why I'm messy. So we'll do this one first. Hold on a second, that's driving me nuts. Now on the bottom, um, what, which is why I've left it messy on the sides here, I'm going to use Urban Decay's 24-7 Velvet Glide On Eye Pencil in Black Velvet. You'll see why. Blend it out just a little. Is that? Funny story is, I used to be able to do this eyeliner when I was 18 years old on the way to the club with my friends. In the car, yeah. in the car, and it would look phenomenal. Now, what you get? It's what you get. I'm gonna be using this generic color that I don't know what the name of the color is. Hold on, there's one more thing. This, I love this. Okay, you're gonna look at it. It's called uh, Lash Out Butterfly, and it's black from L'Oreal. Alright, as you can see, I don't have, see how I have, like, nothing? Like, literally, I have, like, no, none. I have none. Wait till you see this. Hey, the shape of it's a little funky. Like, 50? Alright, so... I don't know, people always make like the sexiest faces when we're trying to do our our lashes, but look at that. Just the bottom, huge difference, right? I can't do that with that because I can't freaking see. Hold on. No, you want to see long lashes. Let's see my husband's lashes. 
Look at that. Look. Huge difference, right? From like this side of that eye. It's ridiculous. <clears throat> I know that a few of my. Well. Uh, well, that was uncalled for. Was. <clears throat> oh, jeez. Okay, I know a few of my friends, my friends, um, have that fiber lash stuff, which, you know, is nice and all, but I can't afford $40, and this was sent to me by Miss uh, Beautiful Alethea, so, if my lashes, you know, I hate that so hard right there. Okay. I'm almost done. There you go. Gives me the illusion that I have eyelashes, which I don't seem to mind. And then what I'm going to do is. This is like a super generic pink lip gloss. I need to go now. Okay. A super generic pink. So I'm going to put this on. Where are my keys? I don't know. Okay. okay. And then the very last thing I'm going to put on. The scope. My husband is rushing the hell out of me. This is Luscious Lipstick from Elf. Uh -huh. And it's a uh, pink lemonade. So it looks like that. Sorry, I had to rush this last part. It's very. Berry. Lipstick. And there you go.